Goldberg's exam. Uh, very sense of humor. Yeah. <laughs> this is the tarsal length instead of. Your friend did not puke on me. This is calcium EDTA, which is a standard anticoagulant used for like looking at cellular morphology. This is a, a potassium EDTA, which is a, a low lead tube, so it's meant for things like heavy metal toxicity measurements. And then lithium heparin is a standard anticoagulant used for if we want to look at chemistries. Thing, but we'll, we'll test the blood lead concentration now uh, with a uh, cage side test or uh, point of care test called the lead care tube, and then the rest of these will bank for future analyses. Okay, so you just need to make sure we keep these guys. And historically, our lead levels have been high. Here. So we're trying to identify the major tendons. Like there's a there's two tendons that come, one of these here, one here. They join, and then this tendon here is very important. This is a major patagial tendon here. This triangle is called the patagium, so it's this flap of skin that's very thin. And there's the bones. So we place the tag so it doesn't interfere with wing movement, but we can still identify the bird. So we'll prep the site with a little alcohol here. This way, and you can see those tendons a little better now. And we'll kind of get a sense of where to place this. First of all, so that it's as comfortable as it can be. One, two, three. There's three adult vultures right here. Mm -hmm. All right, we'll get everything we need. Other than here, yeah, we got everything, I think. All right, let's pick him up and get some pictures. Some new bling for the vulture. Okay, Stella.